Today we're coming from Jeremiah 1, 4 through 10. And it says, Then the word of the Lord came to me, saying, Before I formed you in the womb, I knew you. Before you were born, I sanctified you. I ordained you a prophet to the nations. Then said I, Ah, Lord God, behold, I cannot speak, for I am a youth. But the Lord said to me, I do not say, I am a youth, for you shall go to all to whom I send you, and whatever I command you, you shall speak. Do not be afraid of their faces, for I am with you to deliver you, says the Lord. Then the Lord put forth his hand and touched my mouth, and the Lord said to me, Behold, I have put my words in your mouth. See, I have this day set you over the nations and over the kingdoms to root out and to pull, out, pull down, to destroy and to throw, throw down, to build and to plant. Now, in the Amplified Version, I want to read number five, where he says, Before I formed you in the womb, I knew and approved of you as my chosen instrument. And before you were born, I separated and set you apart, consecrating you. And I anointed you as a prophet to the nations. So, I... um related to Jeremiah because the Lord kept calling me to move forward and I guess um, do more. So he said he knew before you was even born who you was going to be and what you was going to do. And Jeremiah was like, I'm too young. And the Lord like, man, I knew who, I know who you are before you know knew who you were or who you're going to be. So the Lord don't want to hear no excuses. He just wants you to be obedient. Don't be afraid of what people are going to think or say because they're going to say anything yeah. Whether you're doing good or bad, you're still going to have haters. You're still going to have people talking about you, laughing, mocking, and scoffing. But the key thing is to do what the Lord says he wants you to do. He says, go out and preach the gospel. He's going to let the Holy Spirit speak through you. It's not you that's doing all the talking. It's the Holy Spirit doing it. So don't be afraid because the Lord's going to lead you. So that's all for today.